The circumstances surrounding the constitution of the Plateau State House of Assembly took a twist with the swearing in of nine out of 16 members that were declared elected by the Court of Appeal. The ceremony took place at the old government house complex where the legislators have been holding plenary sessions due to the ongoing renovation of the House of Assembly complex. The Speaker, Right Honourable Gabriel Dewan, was not explicit about the criteria for swearing in the nine members, nor the reason for leaving out the seven. You know what may have been delaying this, all this while, you know, first, we were on recess. Two, you know, when court declare members elect, there are some procedures that they have to follow. So I so much believe that they have made up all the criteria now, and they have to be so in. So I don't see anything urgent about it. Well, I was I was in court. I wasn't in court, and neither am I part of the court. But as a speaker, as I said, there are pro processes, there are procedures to be followed, to be integrated. And to the best of my knowledge, mine as a speaker is just integrated. Shortly after the swearing-in ceremony, the newly sworn-in members proceeded to the government house, where they were received by Governor Caleb Mutsuang. He assured them of a robust synergy between the executive and the legislative arm of government. I had been accused of preventing the House from being integrated, members from being integrated. But we had always said it's a House business. And I'm glad that the business has been done by the House. And let me congratulate you for that. I want to assure you that we will serve the interests of Plateau people. I want to assure you that we will collaborate with the House of Assembly. There are many things that need to be put right in our state, and it can only be done with an active, productive legislative house. In a swift reaction, the All Progressives Congress in the state condemned the swearing in, describing it as unacceptable and a violation of democratic tenets. People want to truncate democracy, and it is starting from Plateau State. This is not what is, these are not the provisions of the law. These are not the provisions of the Constitution. Neither are they the provisions of the State House of Assembly. Out of the nine members that were sworn in today, eight of them are members of the All Progressives Congress, and the remaining one is a member of the Labour Party. It's not yet clear what the fate of the remaining seven legislators will be, seeing that the appeal court had declared them winners of the elections. Now.